Hi everyone, I'm back and I've got a second exercise slash challenge for you today. And this is a shoulder stand. Now, I'm gonna give you two variations. The first variation is much more supported and it's where I recommend you start and get really, really comfortable with it before you even consider the more advanced variation where we take the support away. You must be warmed up. This is a tricky exercise. It's a, a, it's a good core strengthener, but it is tricky. So don't feel any pressure to try it. You can completely ignore it. If you are gonna do it, make sure that you've got a nice surface to try on, nice and soft. Um, ideally a mat or even better, more soft. Um, but somewhere that stretches, make sure you've got room around you and that you, you've got a nice safe environment. Okay, um, so I'll show you first. So all we're gonna do is go onto our back. Okay, bring the hands by our side and then we're gonna push through our feet and shoot our legs up in the air. And we want to get to that nice straight position. Aiming to bring the legs completely up in front of us. The supported version involves putting the hands on your back. So we're resting on our upper arm and our hands are supporting our lower back. And it's keeping you nice and straight. So this is achievable for most people. We can practice some variations in this position. We can bend our knees, we can straighten them. Um, I'll show you that in a minute. We can take one leg down to the side of both legs. Try to squeeze up, use your glutes, muscles in your bottom. Try to use your hamstrings um, and your quads to straighten the legs and of course the core. Bend in, rock down and sit up. I'll show you a little variation. Okay, so still with the supported version. There, and go up. Or we can take it down to the diamond, toes touching, and up. Keep pushing up, trust your legs. We can take one leg down, hold it. This is quite a good hamstring flexibility exercise. Take with the other leg down, hold it. Keep pulling up there when you return. Both legs down. Fold over, bring the knees towards the face, and again hold it. All the while holding your back with your hands. Look. The more advanced version, if you want to try this, involves taking the support away. So we are literally going to balance on the shoulders. This is a lot more difficult. It's very important to stay straight and to track straight. It may feel too much pressure on your neck. Try to keep the neck relaxed throughout this. It's hard. Okay. If it starts to feel too much pressure on your neck, carefully come out. Okay. So I'll show you. So what I'm going to do is start off the same. Put back. Push through, down, bring it up to the straight, and then extend. As you can see, it's a lot harder to get the balance. On the spiral side, make your seat like the position somewhat compromised. It's very hard to talk. Okay, so they're entirely on the shoulders. You should have your neck looking straight. See if you can keep the core engaged to keep to get the legs directly up, which way they're not. Keep pushing through the legs. Thumbs up. And we'll roll up. And that's your shoulder sound challenge. Right everybody, have a great day, have a great weekend. Stay safe, bye bye.